Good morning, YouTube. We are here with our uh, December regular series. Uh, and we are starting. Let's get the title screen back to where it was. Come on. We are starting episode 5, Dawn of the Dead, which... Yeah. Which, uh, that sounds kind of weird, considering... Episode 5 is not Dawn of the Dead, it's Sigil, and also it's in the episode 1 slot, what's up with that? Um, well basically this is a, uh, a mod made back in the 90s, I think in the 90s, sometime after uh, uh, Ultimate Doom. As I guess in episode 5 by a fellow named Jan... Oh, I can't read that. <laughs> Vand or something, Vican, something like that, I don't know. But uh, yeah, so this is a very vanilla style episode uh let's jump in on uv it's got some custom music which is really cool i'm gonna turn the sound the music up a little bit there we go now i played this before i didn't get very far but i played this before as a part of the um as part of iron or er, as part of uh dying camel's King of Iron Camel Iron Man Tournament. Oh, uh, hold on a second. There we go. Whoops. Come back. Okay, so yeah, I played this as a part of... Uh... Turn it up a little bit. There we go. No oh, fuck. I'm out of ammo. There we go. Let them in fight. Shit. So yeah, I played this as a part of a Dying Camel's King of Iron Camel Iron Man tournament. Uh, I think I got to the third level. I definitely I remember this first room. Uh, this first room was super cool. So yeah, I guess this was made as like. Uh, an episode four or an episode five, even though it's kind, of, it seems like episode two in difficulty. Nothing. Nothing. We are at 38% health. Good lord, that's a nightmare. So I don't really know what to expect in terms of secrets. Okay, not a bad secret. I approve. I approve of that secret. Turn this up a little bit. There we go. Okay, this reminds me of uh, E1M1 and uh, E2M3 all in one, and that reminds me of E2M1. No, E3M1. That's kind of cool. Odd little room. Is there a secret in here? Doesn't look like it. That's okay. Kind of reminds me of E1M3 with this little corner lake here. Lake in the corner, what I mean.
I don't think... If there's one enemy, you're probably through this door. That was a nice little first level. Felt kind of like a, an E2 kind of thing. Um... Kind of like an E2 or E3 kind of thing. Kind of fits... If it were an episode, it would probably fit best between uh, episode 2 and 3. I would think. So far, at least based on this first level. I don't know about the rest of them. It could be... Totally different, but let's move on to map two. This was map one, warp station. And map two is... The Reactor. More custom music, I like. I think this is from Descent. Or either Descent or Deus Ex. That's kind of cool. That's a nice little trick there. I like that. You, it's a pillar, but then when you walk around the room, it becomes something else. Or it becomes a little room in itself. I, I, I'm liking this level. This level has really cool uh, architecture and geometry. This could, uh, this could be utilized in some way. Uh, that's something that would be great to take note on and I wonder okay yeah there is a texture behind there so in E1M2 of Doom there's something like this but um, the texture back there it's hidden there isn't one there there's no texture there because Romero thought oh nobody's gonna see this it's fine what is that I'm gonna guess Huh. I'm gonna guess that this will lower to reveal the blue key. That's kinda cool. Okay, this reminds me of an E2 thing. Kind of reminds me of the um, yellow key room in E2M2, and back there would be the pillars and yeah, minus the nukage of course, like the pil the four uh, square pillars with the backpack on them, you know. Interesting. I should really read the text files before I start recording. That might be a way back. Or... Yeah. Okay. That's kind of cool. It really blends the styles of uh, Episode 1 and Episode 2. Like, I'd... Like, so far, this would be great to study if, uh, let's say someone was working on a, uh, worked on an Episode 1 map set, or Episode 1 styled map set, and really studied, uh, Romero's maps hard, but, uh, 
as soon as they decide to do the episode 2 style map map set they uh they have a little bit of trouble with the transition studying this might be great for that transition um i'm not 100% confirming but it might be possible might uh, might make that easier it might make that a lot easier cuz there's a lot of uh, ways that uh that some of Sandy styles show up. In here, when a lot of it feels like episode one. Like, this trap feels very Romero-ish, but this room in general feels very uh, Sandy. Oh, vanilla deep water, I like that. I like vanilla deep water. I don't know how to do it though. I know it has something to do with self-referencing lines, but I don't know how to uh, how to do that. So this bridge, it kind of reminds me of um, it reminds me of two things. It reminds me of E1M7, and it also kind of reminds me. Of of map 7 of the level set I made, which was inspired by both E1M7 and and a Heretic a little bit. Kind of hard to see the Heretic inspiration, but if you play uh, my level, there's, there's a little bit of Heretic inspiration in there in that map set. In, in at least the last, in that seventh level, but I'm not going to, uh, I'm going to stop talking about my uh, level set now. I'm guessing... Oh, no, no. I was going to say that they probably teleported in, but I'm thinking... I'm thinking that this just opened. I'm going to steal this real quick. Anything I missed? No. Oh. Yeah, right there. I bet that's going to lower or something. Still. How are we doing on the kills? Get that out of the way. 154 out of 193, not bad. Uh-huh. I'll hit that switch in a second. I just... That switch probably lowers that, but, uh, yeah, where are we? Let's rush back over there and see where that, uh, little hole in the ground leads. Ah, fuck. How the fuck do... You know what? I bet it's where the yellow key is. I'm gonna lose a lot of health, but I want to know what's there. I might even die, so we should save. Oh, come on. Really? Okay, let's hit this switch. Okay, yeah, there has to be a way up there. Or over there. Hmm. Let's rush back.
Because hmm. I'm kind of annoyed because I feel like I totally stepped on that earlier. But I'm probably wrong. Oh, shit. That was lucky. That was totally lucky. Okay, I. Th you press against that, you can totally see the glowing on your gun. I'm guessing that's probably a, a blur sphere, the uh, invisibility. I'm guessing. Damn, I wish there was a way out there. Uh, we'll get to it. For now, though, let's get the armor, even though I can't tell a difference. Uh, I really cannot tell a difference when I am and am not wearing armor. I think armor does damage resistance, but I can't tell. I can't tell a difference. May not be the way to get there. We'll figure it out. We will figure it out. We've got like three more secrets. That's been clicked already. Yeah, I'd rather deal with some pinkies over, or, or oh, some, oh, there's a caca. Second caca of the wand. Yeah, I'd rather deal with some, um, shit. I'd rather deal with some imps over a set of pinkies. Which kind of sounds odd, but that's just kind of what I'd rather do. That might open something. Doesn't seem like it. That may remain a mystery. Unless that does something. No. Again, like, I feel like that's the way to go, but... Not really letting me. Oh! Please have a suit. Ah, oh, fuck! This is where I die. Well, at least I figured it out. I hope I didn't grab the suit like a fucking idiot. Like I did before. Oh, it's after that save. Lovely. Just great. Not mean to hit control. Yes, need that. I don't know how much time I have left, so I'm taking that one. Uh, 
95. Okay, I'm good with 95. Let's get this shit. Kind of play chicken on the stairs. Okay, let's go back to that other secret that I definitely know where it is. Trixie Cacodemon hiding in the exit. Okay, let's uh, conclude the level here. Um, thank you so much for watching. Links to the mod information is going to be down in the description, or in the description, uh, as well as a link to my uh, Twitch and Twitter if you want to keep up with my shenanigans. And if you want to join the community, there's a link to the Discord as well. But until next time, thank you so much for watching, and have a good one.